So now we look at simplifying the power of i or we try to reduce the power of i from a higher index to, uh, the, to the value of i. So here you have to remember again i squared is equals to negative 1. So in this, in this video we have learned how we can convert from i power of 30 into negative 1 or i power of 45 into i. So let's look at some example. Basically we can divide into two. One is even index. Another one is odd index. So this is the even index. We have the same method for even index and the, the other method for odd index. So for even index, start with i squared is negative 1. So from i power of 4, we can change to i squared power of 2 because 2 times 2 is 4. And from i squared is negative 1. So negative 1 power of 2 is positive 1. Now I move on to i power of 6. If power of 6, again in the bracket, we will put i squared. So power of 3 because 2 times 3 is 6. So i squared is negative 1. Negative 1 power of 3 is negative 1. Next, i power of 8. So i power of 8, again in the bracket, we will put i power of 2 and then power of 4. 2 times 4 is 8. So i squared is negative 1. Negative 1 power of 4 will become positive 1. So you can see that the method are the same. So inside the bracket must i power of 2. Whereas for odd index, so i is i, if this is i power of 3, what I do is I try to separate into two parts, i times i squared. So from i squared, I change to negative 1. So negative 1 times i is negative 1. So i squared, i times i squared. So i, actually this is i power of 1 times i squared. So if we try to multiply this i, we will sum out the index. So here will become i power of 3. So 1 plus 2 is 3. So for multiplication, we will sum out the index. So for i power of 5. So ne next I will do is i times i power of 4. So from i power of 4, I change to i squared times uh, power of 2. And then negative 1 power of 2 is positive 1. Here we should have i. Finally, i power of 7. So here is i times i power of 6. From i power of 6, I reduce to this form. And then finally, I multiply. What I should have here is negative i. You can notice that for odd index, this is how we're going to do. Now I will show you four examples. Let's say i power of 56. For i power 56, I can change to, because this is even index, so I can change to i squared, remember, in the bracket must be i squared for the even index, and then power of 28, because 2 times 28 is 56. So i squared, remember, this is negative 1. Negative 1 power of 28. So here we should have positive 1. For i power of 94, this is a this is an inver even index. So again in the bracket will be i squared. So if 94 divided by 2, suppose we have 47. So i squared is negative 1. Negative 1 power of 47 is negative 1. Next, we move on to odd index. So for this odd index, i power of 37, so what I have to do is I will separate into 2 i times i power of 36. So the idea here, the index reduced by 1. So next, i times 36, I can change to i squared. So if 36 divided by 2, Suppose I should have 18. So i squared is negative 1. So it means that negative 1 power of 18. So here is i times 1. So here the answer is i. For 
i power of 67 67 is an odd index or odd uh, numbers so what i should do is i times i 66 Here you can see that the index reduced by one so from 66 i change to i squared times 33 so where i squared is negative one times 33 so i times negative one which is equals to negative i so this is how we reduce the uh, index of uh, complex numbers now we move on to the example five given y is equals one minus four i express i power of 22 conjugate of y here is the conjugate of y over y in the form of a plus bi so first what we have to do is we try to reduce this index i22 so for i22 let's say i22 so i try to reduce the in uh, this index since 22 is a is an even numbers so what i have to do is here is i squared power of 11. so i squared is negative 1 power of 11 here i should have negative 1 so it means that from i 22 now i reduce to negative 1. so next so from here i 22 conjugate of y over y is equals to i 22 is negative 1 so here is negative 1 so the conjugate of y is 1 minus 1 y is 1 minus 4i so the conjugate of y is 1 plus 4i over y y is 1 minus 4i so i try to expand 1 negative 1 times 1 negative 1 negative 1 times 4i negative 4i over 1 minus 4i so next from this division if you want to change to standard form a plus bi remember we have to multiply with the conjugate conjugate of denominator so from 1 minus 4i here is 1 plus 4i same as the numerator 1 plus 4i then we just expand and simplify so negative 1 times 1 is negative 1 minus 4i minus 4i minus 16i squared over 1 times 1 plus 4i minus 4i minus 16i squared so here is negative 1 minus 8i minus 16 i squared is negative 1 over 1 for i minus 4i we can cancel out for uh, i my positive for i minus 4i we can cancel out now it's negative 16 i squared is negative 1 so from here negative 1 minus 8i negative 16 times negative 1 is positive 16 over 1 plus 16 so here negative 1 plus 16 is 15 minus 8i over 17 so here is 15 over 17 minus 8 over 17i so here is the answer so what we should do is first we try to reduce the index of i and then we substitute the value of conjugate of y and y the complex number of y and conjugate y and then in order to transform the division form into standard form we have to multiply with the conjugate 